everybody and welcome back to another episode of Where's My Daddy? Clearly absent because I'm acting like a Pokemon. What's your name? Chai. How old are you? Today, ladies and gentlemen, we're looking at Gen Z faking more disorders. Pretty much these range from autism to DID to Tourette's to anything that they think is potentially quirky. Little warning for any new viewers, um, proceed with caution. Stimming is repetitive or unusual movements or noises. It seems to help some autistic children and teenagers manage emotions and cope with overwhelming situations. Okay, here we got a very real stim, right? Reminder that stimming doesn't have to be pretty to be valid. It's okay to be ugly. You really decided to take your phone out, set up the TikTok, wave your hands like an absolute maniac, and call it a stem, huh? Dude, I swear to god, the internet has changed everything, right? This stuff, like, imagine doing this in public. You would never. But because you have TikTok, which is technically public, right? That's that's what you're doing. You're putting that out, out there for people to see. I don't know why people feel comfortable doing this. Like, you do realize that millions of people are seeing you right now, right? It's, it's just embarrassing. Okay, so we got this girl, right, who's apparently uh, stimming with her friend. This is my best friend. I'm autistic and he's neurotypical. Let's see what kind of um, activities they, they get up to in the bedroom. Life at home has been tough lately, so he asked if we could stim together. You were telling me a, a guy walked up to you and said, Hey, do you want to stim together? Call me Skeptical Sally, but I, I don't think he asked you that. I think I think you both conspired to make this TikTok together, alright? You conspired to put this in front of my eyeballs. He was intimidated at first. I don't blame him, to be honest. If I saw this girl just randomly freaking out, I would call the police. But we got more comfortable as we kept stimming. Can you stop? Don't use the word stim. You don't deserve- Come on, you're telling me this is real. Conveniently, when you start recording your TikTok, you start freaking out like an absolute maniac. I haven't stimmed in front of other people since I was seven. Cool, maybe there's a reason for that. Maybe we can keep it that way. You're a full grown adult faking disorders on TikTok. Great, are you proud of yourself? Hey yo, um, I don't mean to judge, but what, what, what exactly were they doing at the end? I feel like your stimming is slowly transforming into uh, something else, let's just say. Okay, listen, I, I don't want to be that guy, you know, who uh, clowns on our generation. Um, I don't know why I said that. I made like 500 videos. But, but, but listen, I cannot imagine. Like, listen, I'm part of this generation, right? Generation Z. The absolute innovators, the, the, the future of society, right? I just can't imagine myself doing this with anybody like dude i swear to god half of these people were diagnosed from tiktok they watched other tiktoks and they're like hey i jump on the bed too i must have autism that's just kind of how it works you know okay moving on to a classic right did dissociative identity disorder basically tiktokers use it as an excuse to portray their characters as uh alters right and this next one is plain embarrassing they're faking did again except they start acting like children and pokemon and uh, their handle is that lonely dark prince so uh yeah give gives you that that sense of maturity right what's your name chai how old are you it's eight 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 like the like the finger yeah yeah I love how the person recording fits the role so perfectly. They're, they're talking as if they're talking to an insane person, which is pretty accurate considering they're faking their disorder. Don't mind me guys, I'm just gonna turn into a Charmander and call it my altar. Don't get too close, I might use Fire Blast. Uh, what's your gender? I'm a boy. And your pronouns? He's him. <laughs> and what's your role in the system? Uh. Yeah. Oh yeah, that, that's really fascinating. This apparent eight-year-old who can barely pretend to be a Pokemon somehow has a complete understanding of DID and knows their role in their system as well. That's that's very interesting. I don't know about you guys, but uh, the eight-year-olds I've encountered, they act a little bit different. This seems more like a, an adult pretending to be an eight-year-old. Yeah, little. Uh, what's your avatar nation thing? Uh, 
I used to have a tar. Yeah, you are. I used to have a tar. <laughs> um, and who, who's that? Who, who are you oh, holding? Uh, oh, who are uh, they? This is Mr. Dino, and this is Mr. Dino Poopy, and they married and go kiss, 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 kiss. Imagine, bro. Imagine being a full-grown adult, recording yourself and putting this on TikTok. Like, you watch it back, and you go, eh, okay, be what are you doing? Cringe. I don't know about you guys, but people pretending to be babies just really pisses me off. Like, even even when those TikTok girls were doing it, like, unironically to attract, like, uh, older men or whatever, that pissed me off then. But this is a new level, like, Miss Dino and Miss, Mr. Dino, puppy and married, go kiss, kiss. Uh, Are followers really that worth it? I know you ain't getting a dime off of this content, all right? I don't care how famous you're getting on TikTok. You ain't making a dime, so why? I don't understand. All right, so this next one is this person having tics, right? ADHD slash ADD tics or sensory issues. Oh, okay. Whoa, 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 what just happened there? You, you, you turned into a, a demon. Malicious. New altar. Sterling split on Easter. Fronting. I, I don't know what, what, do you, do I need a new dictionary to read this now? Bro, I swear to God, these people come up with another new language. You can't find this stuff on the Oxford Dictionary, okay? Me when somebody steals my Robux. Urgh, transformation. I am now malicious. Uh. Listen, my question is, why are you acting like a dog, though? Like, what the heck is this? What the dog doing? Like, what, what are you doing there? Okay, so this next one's one of my favorites, right? We got this person faking DID. And uh, take a look at one of their alters named Trauma Holder. This is me. This is me. Don't never buy no weed from the gas station, bro. Well, hello, Joey. It seems like you have a lot of trauma. Is that is that how you act all day, every day? Is that is that is that how you do it, bro? The only trauma I got is from this damn TikTok. What are you feeding our population? You know, I always wonder why did Gen Z turn out like this, right? Why did it turn out so bad? And I feel like there's a lack of good role models because if if Joey Trauma Holder is your role model, I mean, of course you're gonna turn out busted in the head. You just changed your hair and clothes. This is not DID, you absolute moron. What the heck is even up with Vivi? Are you wearing a mop on your head? Stop. Okay, so this next one is probably the worst one of them all, but it may be fake, right? You, you guys can tell me in the comments, but my God, this was this was hard to sit through. You guys, please stop hating on me. It's so, so sad. And I've got a cancerous brain tumor. And I think I'm gonna die soon, please. <laughs> Yeah, you definitely got some form of cancer. I mean, how is anyone gonna believe you when your account name is at ticks fidget? You, you created this account for the sole purpose of being this absolute cancerous individual. <laughs> Honestly, F in the chat for the stress ball, though. Jesus, you pummel that. Okay, this is one of my favorites, right? We, we got this person pretending to have DID, and they basically taste like a, a chocolate or a dessert three, three, four times. They, they taste, the, the same person tastes it three, four times, and they pretend it's, it's like they're different alters. And they're like, oh yeah, I, I, I like this, but then my alter hates this. Yeah, that's a perfect way of proving you have DID. So we're the Sage system, and we are going to be doing a round robin where we try food that none of us have tried before and see how our tastes differ. So we've had mochi before, but we've never had like strawberry frozen mochi. So I'm gonna try this. I don't like the texture on the outside, but it's like strawberry, so it's delicious. It's really sweet, but strawberry ice cream's good, so I like it. I love strawberry stuff, so this is really good. I like this whole thing. I really like mochi, so I'm excited. That's good. I like the regular mochi better, I think. Mm -hmm. Is it like a mandatory requirement that if you're faking DID, you have to have a baby altar? Like, 
all of them without without fail like what are, what are you trying to appeal to i love the absolute minimal effort they put in not even trying to change the personality whatsoever they just changed the name at the top and ate the sweet again and again and again we were all pretty similar on this one guess most of us like mochi no you like mochi shut up we got another meet my altar session but well, instead of that, why, why don't you meet your principal, you know, for your failing grades in class? Because they're making these damn TikToks. You know who's my favorite? It's gotta be Axel the Crackhead because it really sums you up. <laughs> okay, I think I speak for a majority of the population when I say, you're not cute. Nobody thinks you're cute. Please stop doing that. It's so incredibly disturbing. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Ah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Honestly, what, what the heck are you even excited for? Because dad's not coming back. My sister and her friends have been faking Tourette's for the last 20 minutes watching Miraculous. Bro, you know what my, me and my friends did when we were this age? We used to play sport heads football on the school uh, during IT period, all right, in school. Come on. We're literally watching how these people even came to be. They watch something on TikTok and they try to emulate it even though they don't have the problem at all. You're a disappointment to your family and society at large. Please stop. Anyways, if you want to be sane, subscribe. Bye-bye.